Hello Sagittarius, welcome to your weekly, sorry, weekend love readings. These will be from the 17th until the 19th of July. What are you holding on to, Sag? Um, don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel. Leave a comment down in the comment section below. Also, these are general love readings, so they're not going to resonate with every single person every single week. If it's not resonating with you this week, that's okay. Hit the notification button if you haven't already, and then go and check out one of the other tarot readers here on YouTube. This is a weekend read, which means that it is a shorter read than what I normally do. If you're interested in more detailed readings with your feelings and your other person's feelings, make sure that you either subscribe so you get the weekly reading update or hit me up in the um using the details below for a personal reading all right so you're obviously holding on to something all right and holding on like white knuckle holding on all right love messages please for Sagittarius love messages for Sagittarius okay yeah it's time to let go mm-hmm Ten of Wands in reverse. Looks like you were letting go this weekend. Yeah, and you're letting go at, at kind of whatever it takes. You're going to release this situation. I'll take two more, actually, please. Thank you. Haha. <laughs> ha. So this might actually might be someone else trying to hold on to you, Sagittarius. I was called to take two, so... Princess of Swords, though. Let's get some clarifiers. What's the Four of Pentacles, please? Four of Pentacles. Yeah, this is someone like is trying to stop you from leaving. Um, because I definitely am picking up this as you. And they might be, they might, they're either aware that you're leaving because they're spying on you or they're going to say whatever they have to to try and get you to stay. They're going to give you the guilt. They're going to do whatever they have to to get you to stay. What is the Princess of Swords in reverse, please? This is a familiar storyline, Sagittarius. Why is it so? Oops. Yeah, see, they're going to use everything they know about you against you to get you to stay. The High Priestess, they're calling on all of their subconscious intuition uh, to know what to say. To And it doesn't matter how, it's not going to be stuff that's, I love you, blah, blah, blah. It's going to be, this is your fault and you're going to make me, I don't know, hurt myself or whatever. Um, I'm never going to recover. It's like guilt tripping you into this. What's the Ten of Wands, please? Ten of Wands in reverse. King of Pentacles, yeah, you're like, I don't want to be in this anymore. I don't want to be part of this anymore. What's the most likely outcome? Most likely outcome for Sagittarius. That's the thing about this deck is it's just such a, <laughs> it just says it exactly how it is. Like it doesn't mince words. Having this conversation in a personal read uh, just earlier. Prince of Swords, yeah, you're just like, you know what? I'm getting on with it and it's going to be quick. And I know it's going to hurt, but I have to cut you off with my sword. That is it. We are done. World card. It is over. And they're going to fight. They're going to say that it's going to be a fight for you to get away. Now, if these are general readings, remember, so if you're feeling like this is in reverse, then take it in reverse. But also note what the other person is experiencing in reverse, right? That will help you. I'll take one more, please. Yeah, you're like, I'm not offering anything. This is over. Over. Nothing being offered here. And it's going to happen very quickly. Okay. Um, interesting. All right. Let's see what advice we have for Sagittarius. Advice for Sagittarius, please. Queen of Wands. Yeah, taking action. Taking back control. She's one of my favorite queens. Yeah. 
taking back control and moving forward. This is going to happen very quickly. I think what's going to happen is you're going to make up your mind and you're just going to be like, right, that's it. I'm done. I don't care what you've got to say. I don't care how much you try and convince me to stay again. It's not happening. Um, one more. Whoops. Yeah, you're like, I'm communicating how I feel to you, which is... I am not going to, you know, be fooled into staying. I will do what I need to do and put myself first. Let's see what romance, Angel. You're going to be having that conversation. And it's going to be a difficult conversation, I think. But you'll be speaking from the very depths of your spirit. I think you can't pretend anymore that you can do it is the other thing. Uh, romance, Angel, advice, please, for Sagittarius. I just got the honeymoon is over. Yeah, you may need some holiday time, some time away. It says enjoy the bliss of holiday time together, but this is about you having holiday time on your own because you're moving away from this person. So it's just saying this is that you need a holiday. Um, yeah, that's what I've got for you, Sagittarius. Don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel. Hit me up for a personal reading if you're interested, and I will talk to you for the weekly reads. Talk to you soon. Bye.